Today we're going to answer a question, in fact right now, that I know a lot of you go to bed thinking about. And that's pretty straightforward. What's more powerful? Is it a twin turbo V6 gasoline powered pickup truck? Or is it a twin motor electricity powered pickup truck? Or is it a diesel straight six turbo Cummins, Andre? Oh, I know. Yeah, that's pretty easy, right? Uh, we hook up some trailers, we go towing on the Ike. Nope, we're not going to do that today, but we're going to do something much more fun, if a little bit less informative. What? Yeah, we're going to go do a tug of war. Let's do it. Three, two, one, go. That's a cow pie, Andre. Uh, are we going to also toss cow pies? We are not tossing cow pies, but we may toss them inadvertently <laughs> <laughs> with all four wheels. <laughs> so how are we going to do this, Roman? I think we do like a very simple bracket. How about the hybrid, which is the V6, yeah. takes on the Lightning, okay. and then the winner takes on the Ram. But Roman, I think the, the viewers out there are wondering this because it's more than just power and torque. It's about weight of these trucks. Yeah, you know, that's a good point. But since we're doing this on dirt, and you may be wondering, why are we doing this on dirt? Yeah, why? Because we don't want to destroy the drivetrains of any of these trucks. Right. So yeah, usually weight is a big determining factor. But you know, sometimes we do all these very serious videos. I thought today, let's just have some fun. And four wheel drive, right? Four wheel drive. Well, we have to, because the Lightning is all wheel drive all the time. So it would be unfair if the other two went into two wheel drive. So cones? Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's a problem. That's a problem. What's up? Oh, uh, is the hole too small, Roman? The hole's too small. Okay. And through magic of video, it's connected. Maybe. Come on, Tim. There we go. 27, 28, 29, 30. Perfect. I was afraid it was going to not be an even number. Okay. So 15 paces, Andre. 14, 15. That's okay, the right okay, there. okay. Hold on, hold it, hold it. So all you got to do is move it like a couple of feet either way. You're a winner, winner, chicken dinner. Well, I am looking forward to this because this F-150 right here, it is a King Ranch and it's a little bit more traditionally powered, right? A V6, three and a half liters, two turbochargers, 430 horsepower and 570 pound-feet of torque. It's because there is an electric motor helping it out as well that's sandwiched be behind this V6 and in front of that 10-speed automatic transmission. And of course it has four-wheel drive and it's going to go up against the electric cousin. Under the hood of the all-new Lightning is a lot of beeping and also a lot of cables. <laughs> uh, well, actually, adapters, cables, extension cords, chargers, and an Alaska plate. <laughs> uh, this truck uh, was the first, we think, electric pickup truck that went all the way to uh, Prudhoe Bay, the northernmost point in the United States. But actually, uh, this is all-wheel drive, like Roman was saying. There's an electric motor in the front axle, there's an electric motor in the rear axle, independent suspension all the way around, 580 horsepower combined, so more horsepower and more torque, uh, 775 pound-feet of it. So this will be pretty interesting. It also weighs more than the hybrid by about, what, a thousand pounds. All right, so how about this? I've got two turbochargers, I have an electric motor, I have four-wheel drive, I'm going to go to four low, I need a torque multiplication, I have a 373 rear axle ratio, and I have, uh, well, my right foot. All right, well, I've got uh, all the torque in the world, Andre, and all the horsepower in the world, uh, so this should be good. So are you ready to do this? Well, I'm a little nervous. Why are you nervous? Well, you have a thousand pounds more in your truck your truck weighs more and you have more torque 
Well, you know, tell you what. Uh, if you lose this one, why don't you go and jump in the ram, and that way uh, it'll be more fair. <laughs> I was hoping you would say that. You ready? Yes, so you counted down. Three, two, one, go! No! I think we know who the winner is. You know, you know what happened? I, th I think it took me uh, like a fraction of a second to build torque. And uh, you didn't. I mean, you pulled me right away. Yeah, well, you know, uh, that's the thing about electric motors, right? They get all their torque immediately. Uh, yeah, yeah. So I, I, all I can say is I need to bring the big guns. It, it smells now. The uh, I smell tire smoke. I smell maybe some gear, hot gears. I, I yeah, the traditional truck didn't quite have it. I smell. That's the smell of winter, Andre. That's what that is. Oh, I thought you were gonna say cow pies. <laughs> oh, no, that's there too. So that's winter, but a little bit of cow pie as well. And yes, we're using the Cummins Turbo Diesel as the equalizer because really this truck, this is a heavy duty truck, so it's heavy. It's got a big honking engine. It's got a turbocharger, of course. This is a standard output 6.7 liter turbo diesel, 370 horsepower and 850 pound feet of torque. So it's the torquiest of all these trucks and it's also the heaviest by about another thousand pounds. Let's see if it can win. Well, Roman, I brought a big boy. You certainly did. Uh, so you got uh, more weight, but I still have more torque, don't I? No, I, I'm the torque king now. I've got 850 of them. And I also have like an 8,000 pound mass. So this truck weighs, what, 7,200? It's got 100 pound foot of torque less than yours. Uh, approximately. So yeah, so this could be interesting. All right, well, let's find out. Let's see if electric can take diesel or if diesel can take electric. Same thing, three, two, one, go. Okay, you ready? Yep. So I'm in four low once go. again. Three, two, one. Hey, you're going, stop it. Were you cheating? No, I was building boost, dude. All right, fair enough. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, go. Oh, it's close. Oh, they're just digging in. Truck control is off. It's back in. <laughs> All right, well, let's not burn out these trucks. All right. Let's let off. Three, two, one, let off. <laughs> All right, let's go see if anybody won. I have no idea, but dude, the ram was stubborn. Very stubborn. I think the ram wins it. No, the, the lightning wins it by a hair, dude. And that's because of that instant torque. But basically they're both, right? They weren't going anywhere. You know, I was- It I'll, was dug in. It was dug of. in, mine yeah. kind of dug in too, so yeah. So it was interesting. I was looking in my mirror yeah. and on the lightning, yeah. um, I think the traction control or the computer almost was preventing you from like yeah. spinning too much. Because look, come, come over here. Look, there, there's nothing. Not much. I mean, were these guys tires even spinning? I don't see it spinning. Right? I mean, look at the fronts were, right? But Maybe. I don't think the back tires were actually spinning. Are you saying you won this with uh, three tires versus... Was that one spinning? Four? Yeah. Uh, yeah? Yeah. No, there's nothing. A little bit. I don't know. I think those just locked up. Really, look at yours. You've got a little dirt. I have a lot of, I have a lot of spinach. Yeah. 
Is that a word, spinach? Yeah, spinach. Yeah, look, you dug in. You completely dug in. I dug in everywhere. I dug in in the front, I dug in in the back. Yeah. Oh, I think the lightning was protecting his drivetrain, probably. Yeah. Uh, so there you have it. Uh, I think the difference is that instant torque. Right? I say whatever you want. Yeah, instant torque? It's just, it's just, like, it's just like a prairie dog's nose. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> so the lightning guy wins it by a prairie dog's nose. And I feel like we haven't actually uh, uh, really proven um, much here, Andre. No, but we had some fun. Yeah, we had some fun because this tows a boatload more than that. <laughs> yeah, and further. And it hauls a boatload more than that further. And, <laughs> yes. but, but that instant torque is good. Imagine. Oh, you're going to hate this, guys. Oh, you what? may hate this. What? Imagine when they build because they will do it. You know what I'm going to say? What? Heavy duty uh, electric duty? truck. <laughs> yes. Well, we kind of have one because it's the Hummer. It is Where's the Hummer? Hummer? Okay. I think that's coming up next. All right. All right. All right. To be continued. When we yeah. get the Hummer, we'll try that again. All right. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Ciao.